Steve, bad luck today. Never really got started in the first half, did we? No, I just said to the boys in there, I said, um, it seemed like we only played for half hour today. Um, somehow I can't give them, I can't give them belief. And they, they've got to have it themselves, so I can't put my finger on it why, you know? But, but we can't be a yo-yo side. Can't, can't be good one week, Bogner last week exceptionally well, and this week it's that foot off the pedal. Um, because give them credit, they beat us, um, but they're on the back of four defeats, you know? And whether it's been warranted or not, as you see there, when we scored the goal, they seem to have fought away a little bit, you know, but then we've given two goals. I think Tony's had many more saves to make. Um, but we don't get them opportunities where people just let us run through one on one with a keeper. Um, so that's got to be addressed. Um, but yeah, we only play for half hour, Jim, and that's not good enough. You know, a week's uh, a long time or a short time football, I don't know how you want to say it, because Bogner, you know, beat them and beat them comfortably, and you get everyone sing that praise at the end and stuff and then today you get a minority doing it because we get beat which is fair enough but uh, I'm in for as long haul as I can be I want everyone to stick together good or bad and as I say we're, we're clapping empty stand you know if people don't want to stay about because we get beat um, whether it's the manner that they don't like and they want to walk off without showing appreciation that's fine I don't mind that but my players will still do the same thing, whether they win, lose or draw. Um, but they're despondent because they know they've let themselves down. Um, it's five defeats we've had this season. The two uh, late goals against Merstrom and Enfield are coming to fruition now, you know, because of that defeat. But we've got to keep going, you know. We're not going to throw the towel in. We've got to beat a game of football, you know. No given right to win. Um, we watched them against Dulwich and they were very unlucky. They could have made it two all. Um, so like I say, it was a game where we didn't get started, they know that, they've been told that um, and we hope that we can start from the off against Camby Island. Unfortunate injury to Nathan though, wasn't it? Very early on, it means you've got to change everything around, but like everything. But yes, you, ha you have, but you can't just rely on one person, can you? You know, it ain't the Nathan Elder team, it's not the Nick Wheeler team, I've got a squad there, you know, and today was the first time it made an impact when the subs come on, like this season. I've made subs this season and we haven't really had the impact that we had last year um, and I thought today when they come on forget the goal straight away because that, that, that's more luck than judgement I think by bringing subs on at that time and scoring um, but I felt we, we showed more of an urgency and endeavour maybe throwing bodies forward um, and that was with 20-25 minutes to go and uh, we, look, we, looked up, we looked better for it you know because we was on the front foot I thought it was a bit tentative in the first half and then we've been pretty much handed a get out of jail card and we haven't taken it with the save penalty, which was a good save, I'm sure. But Yeah, good save on their part, bad miss on our part, but penalties, if, if a goalkeeper saves it as a hero, um, I, I've already read the script that people are going to say, well, he took a penalty and he missed it on Tuesday, but before that he scored three. And all three went in the same corner, the keeper went that way and couldn't get near him. You know, he's gone the right way today and he saved it. So that's, that's the thing with penalties. Um, you're either a hero or a villain. You know, if he puts it in and it's two all, we might go and get a third or, or they're singing his praises that he, he's brought us back from, from nothing. Um, but it wasn't to be. So we've just got to look forward to Canvey. You know, they've come here and they've done well. They've, um, Staines that is, you know, they, they've managed the game well, 2-0 up, you know, the goalkeeper taking time. But listen, if that's what they do, that's what they do. And, and you wouldn't expect anything different because they've been on the back of four defeats on the spin. Lucky enough, we've only had one defeat in five. So, uh, they're not calling for his head at Staines. Hopefully they're not calling for mine here, because there's still a lot of football to play, and I've just told the boys in there, we've got to be positive come Tuesday. Definitely, definitely. Uh, so, Nathan's injury, is that, is that just a hamstring? or Hamstring, we don't know. He's, he's annoyed with himself now, um, as he would be, because he wants to play, but Melvin will have a good look at that Tuesday, and we'll see where we're at. But it doesn't look too good at the moment. You know, we've had hamstring before George Bevan, um, which wasn't wasn't very good. So we'll see. Mel Melvin's very good, so hopefully he's in good hands with with Melvin. Good. Well, bad luck today, and uh, we hope for better news on Tuesday for Canby. Hopefully, Jim. Cheers, Steve. Thanks. Thanks, John. Steve. Ready. Uh, Tom, what do you think about today's game? Um, uh, we've, we've had enough chances to win. Um, they, 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 they've they've had probably two or three chances and took them and. Um, if we want to be near the top of the league, we've got, we've got to start taking them. But um, there was some positives to take out of it. We, we did create a lot of chances. Um, 
most of the game he was on the front foot, but fortunately it was just one of them days where they've had three chances, scored two, we've probably had seven or eight and not taken ours. Mm. It, it, it seemed the best spells were before they scored and then after they scored their second we made the substitutions. The bit in the middle, I suppose, is the bit where we lost the game, wasn't it? Yeah, I, just switching off twice. I mean, the first goal was a mistake, um, that things like that happen. Um, the second one was a, a diag and the, and the key just uh, edited it and, and it's gone in. It weren't a bad edit, but apart from that, I thought we, 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 weren't, we weren't terrible today. We were just um, probably not good enough in both boxes. Mm. Uh, the penalty incident, uh, tell us what you... Uh, I, to be fair, the ball was there and I had two fellas pulling me back, so um, I, I, I don't know if the red card was for the pulling back or what he said to the referee, but it was definitely a penalty. I think he, he said on Twitter it wasn't, and obviously that's presumably what he and his teammates were saying to the referee. Yeah, probably, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because you did the same the other way around, weren't we? Yeah, yeah exactly. From defence, yeah, yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. And annoyed it was a penalty, wasn't it? I bet Luke's. So. Yeah, I mean, yeah, uh, he went a bit early, but uh, it's one of them. It's, He's in the target and the keeper's made a decent save, so it's just unfortunate. What about yourself now? Um, back in the side for a uh, Yeah, yeah I feel all right now, just to get yeah. a bit of back match fitness back. It's, it's mm. good to be out playing, it's frustrating when you're not. Um, but yeah, it's, I've, I've enjoyed com coming back in. The, bo uh, the boys have been um, have done well. We, we have, we've had a lot of injuries this season, and um, it does take its toll on any squad. And when you've got five, six out at a time, um, but yes, we have got a bit, uh, better squad this year. But I mean, if you look at the bench now, people that are coming on today have, have made a massive impact. Where when, you, when you've only got 11, 12 players, we haven't had that. And, and uh, I still think we'll be there about to come the end of the season. We're, we're still um, a couple of things that we need to work on in training. But apart from now, I, I can still see us having another good season. What was the talk in the, in the dressing room today about how to address that for Tuesday? Um, got to be a little bit more clinical. We've got to be better in both boxes, which, which we have to be. Um, but don't don't beat yourself up too much. We've got to, we've got to go and, and make sure we get three points Tuesday now. Mm. And I guess I suppose on the day when you know some of those that cleared off the line. I think you've had two cleared off the line. In yeah, I mean the ball won't go in for me this season. Anything I hit last year went in, and this season it ain't. But yeah. um, as long as the team, we, I don't care who scores. But um, unfortunately, we, we haven't won today. But um, I'm confident we'll, we'll get back to winning ways Tuesday. Thanks, Thanks. 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 Than